But when he offered me the part, I jumped all over it. And I actually left wrestling to fight. And about a week after, uh, I had talked to uh, Strike Force, a promotion that I was going to fight for and probably still will, will be fighting for. I, uh, he offered me the part, and I made it the priority of my life. You know, to get this, this movie done before I did anything, just because I was really so excited to work with him. When I talked to Riza about the movie itself, and I knew he was going to put a like, kind of a modern, updated twist on it and make it also a love story. And uh, I just thought it just sounded so interesting. When I first thought about it and read the script, I thought it sounded like kind of like a, a Kung Fu Star Wars, you know, just with all the different clans and these. Uh, just, it, it's just like such a, a kung fu fantasy world. It's been really, really easy working with him. You know, first and foremost, because he, he's my friend. You know, Riz is my friend. And I really just, I just I have a genuine love for the guy. He's such, just such a good, just such a good-hearted person. I mean, he's just, you know, there's just nothing, uh, it's just, you know, it, there's nothing bad about the guy. He's just such a positive spirit and a good, uh, a good natured person. He's just very positive, very creative, and uh, you know he's he's really just uh, he's kind of carried me through this and helped me because you know this is all a new venture for me. I think if you break Brass Body down, what he is really is a mercenary. He doesn't. I don't think he's <laughs> necessarily a. a a horrible person, which you know is obvious in the, you know, for the opening scene where he's got the little kids and he's carrying the little kids around. Um, but I think you know basically what he wants is money, and he will do anything for money. Rizza came in one day and he said, you know, what are you most known for in wrestling? And I said, probably the powerbomb. And he said, well, we want you to do that in the movie. And I was. I, I don't know, how are we going to do that? How are we going to make that work? He said, you know, we'll make it work. We want you to do something just for the wrestling fans, which I thought was really cool. Because that is really, they'll see this, my wrestling fans, or the wrestling fans will see this, and they'll, they'll identify with it, you know, right off the bat. And I think they're all going to, you know, and this is really kind of, it was his way of letting me pay homage to, to my fans from wrestling.